I'm going to run through some of the main riffs uh, from Mercy. It's probably one of the more straightforward songs on the album. We just wanted to go for like a really dark and cold kind of atmospheric thing. So the first thing you hear, the intro riff is... <laughs> to go for some kind of like 70s rock or like early Merciful Fate kind of thing before it kicks into something really heavy just for a bit of contrast so that is kind of essentially just um, kind of low gain saying you've got that it's seventh fret on the D string fifth fret on the G and you've got an A there as well so and you move that position up two frets so you've got uh, the ninth fret on the D and then the seventh fret on the G string and the A string again in there, so... So that bit there, the... You've got 9 on the D, 12 on the G, and then you move to 10 on the D, 9 on the G, and then down back to that other shape. So, right, so the whole thing... So the main riff, like under the verses, is this one. And basically, the rhythm is. Basically, you've just got an E and the A string together and you're moving notes around on the A. So you have 10, 9 and 12. I'll play it with one finger just so it's more obvious what's going on. So even slower, I'll do it with less gain as well. So the next bit is just this. I'm down picking an A, uh, a power chord and we want to get some kind of black metal, kind of cold sounding vibes over the top. So um, Bailey, uh, the guitarist, is doing this. So that's the same kind of stuff as uh, the intro riff. So you've got. only playing the A, D and the G string in that bit. So coming out of the verses there's this kind of tail end. So slowly. And that's harmonised with... And on the recording there's a few more harmonies laid up, so there's like an octave as well. Right, so the uh, the pre-chorus is just kind of like picked chords, which is... time around that last chord there is this I think that's a sus chord right so um that bit broken down you're just doing a E minor shape then to an A minor kind of thing top of that the other guitar is doing this with some delay on it and I'll back the gain off so you can make out the notes. Uh, in terms of the chorus it's kind of simple it's just uh, power chords 
down picking them all and it's just um, inverted power chords for most of it and normally with inverted power chords you tend to play like a power chord on the A string with the E string in there as well um, a lot of the time when we do this kind of stuff we only play the low two strings um, so they just end up praying it with one finger but you can add that note in or whatever if you want so normally it's Right, so I'll slow that down. You're starting with an A, then C, D, D. And that's harmonized with this. In terms of like the kind of rhythmic groove thing in there, it's just a single. And um, when the drums kick in, it just goes to a power chord, so you just add in the second fret on the A string. Um, so that's it in terms of most of the riffs, uh, apart from the very end one, which is a really slow kind of doomy riff. Um, we use like an octave thing on the guitar, so an octave lower as well, um, just to sound super heavy. And it is this. <laughs> Thank you.